Hey guys, Jake up here. This is going to be a quick video on something I haven't really decided to cover yet. I was actually not really thinking about doing this, but one of my buddies, you know who you are, uh, suggested that I do this, and I'm going to start doing it. Maybe not be on Fridays or you know maybe uh, right away, but it's almost like we're going to be on Saturdays or Sundays due to the fact or when I can upload them early as possible. I'm going to try to do them on Fridays as much as possible or do them Saturday morning, but these are going to be vendor reset videos or top picks of things I think you should pick up. This week's all not that great. There's actually one item you guys will see later on that it's probably the best item I've seen uh, in a while at a DZ vendor, but you guys will see. But starting off, this is the base of Ops. He's, he's selling a Petrov Defense Group backpack. So if you are looking for a backpack that's Petrov, you can just buy one here. Uh, but you might be better off just going around looking for one because this one's actually not all that great. But he is selling one, so if you guys are trying to look for one, you can go ahead and pick this up. It does also have Harden on it, so if you're looking for armor, you can roll that onto another backpack. But this is a 22% damage to elite skill power, um, you know, mask with this China light. So if you guys want skill power for the next update, since that's most likely going to be used a lot due to the fact the skills are you know, being changed a little bit, it does have skill power, so you can it's almost 200, and it also has 10%. So you can roll that onto something else of your liking. He's also selling a Richter and Kaiser. Uh, holster, but it's purple, and he's also selling an 870 Express shotgun. So unless you guys have some stats on here, like you know the health on kill or you know a stat on the gun you can use, I recommend picking them up. But next is going to be the purple backpack. It's also a Providence, and he's selling a chest piece that has hard hitting and berserk. So if you need either of those talents, you can go ahead and pick that up and roll it onto something you really want. He's selling a skill power mask with 225, and he's selling the clutch gloves. Which so if you guys need clutch. Uh, you could go ahead and pick that up and roll that into something else. Other than that, he's not really selling much besides a few rolls that you guys could use, like weapon damage, maybe if you need skill power. He is selling crit chance on these gloves, so if you need those, you can pick them up. But other than that, the weapons this week that this guy's selling are really not that great, so unless you need a talent off of them that you want to try or a talent that you're looking for, then you can go ahead and pick these up. But personally, uh, there's only two weapons, which is this M700 Carbon that has Allegro and it's 493. You could roll Spike with something else and use that in the Unhinged Tactical M249 Para. You could roll it onto something else if you really want to. Next is going to be the Theater Settlement. He's selling pretty much nothing here as well, sadly. 11,000 health roll on a backpack, so if you need some health. Crit Chance on the gloves. If you're looking for a Crit Chance roll, you could roll those onto something else. He is selling a Skill Power which skill haze surge mask so if you want skill haze for the next patch i suggest you pick it up an allegro and eyeless military mark 17 so if you want those rolls on a rifle you can go ahead and take allegro off and throw it on something else he's also selling some blueprints you guys can pick up also next is the campus he's selling or she's selling a vital chest piece that has 20 percent health so if you need vital you can pick that up also hard hitting overlord knee pads with armor regeneration, a police M4 with a Legro on it, Vindicative. So if you need a Legro on an AR, you can pick that up. 8% SMG. So if you guys need SMG damage, that's there as well. And she's selling a few blueprints as usual. Next is going to be the Dark Zone vendor, which is going to be DZ West. Uh, she's only selling one item that if you guys really need, I guess you can use, and that's going to be the Overload Armored knee pads that have hard hitting in total armor. Uh, either you could roll the total armor to something you really want if you want to have total armor, but there's way better pieces you could probably get, like, you know, 11%, 11.5 is the highest I've ever seen. So, but if you just want these to have them and get that roll as a stat roll, you can, you know, buy them and pick them up, but you could probably find better ones out there. Next is going to be the Dark Zone South vendor, and this is the main thing I recommend you guys pick up. And they're selling a Wyvern backpack with destructive and hard hitting, if you guys want that. Also a purple holster. But the next thing is going to be the main piece I highly recommend picking up, which has total armor, health, and weapon damage on the ropes and hardened. So you can actually use the total armor and roll on something else. That's 18.5% total armor. They were selling a 30% total armor vest a while ago, which people are going to pick up. So if you guys need a backpack that has 18% total armor, or if you have one higher, you probably won't need this. But if you want to buy this just for the roll, I highly recommend you buy this because it's the highest I've ever seen on a backpack for sale at any of the vendors and you can buy a few of these and roll them on future builds and just keep them in your stash. Next is the East Vendor. She's selling 11% shotgun damage gloves so if you guys are making a shotgun build you guys can you know get 11% shotgun damage you guys really need it and she's also selling hard hitting knee pads with armor generation that are purple but other than that she's selling a Vector SBR 45 ACP 
with Reload Speed, which is Jazz Hands and Vindicativ. So I recommend picking up those gloves, also the Clutch Gloves, and mainly the Gila Guard Backpack with the 18.5% armor roll. But that's about it, guys. I will be doing these pretty often and telling you guys what's for sale. The people I did not list this week is Cassie Mendoza and tell you guys what she's selling due to the fact I already did make two videos on her, which you guys should see those already because I did upload them before this. But thank you guys all for watching. I will catch you guys in the next one. We had the training. We fought to protect the weak. But training doesn't prepare you to hunt someone you used to call brother. He has left us no other choice. If we don't stop him, there will be nothing left to save.